All right. Uh, I restarted the game. I also looked at the Epic Store because I was I want to see because I have one of the DLC. So I was like, well, do I will I get the other DLC? I don't have the deluxe edition, so I don't know why I have some of the DLC already. Um, but the Epic Store sucks so ass. I can't tell what I fucking own other than the base game. So apparently, I own some of the DLC. Whatever. Oh, see, look, mouse wheel works now. It's so stupid. Such a shame. Is there like an achievement for petting the deer or something? This is weird. That one has a lot of whiskers. Yeah, look. Okay. One of Kadamu Park's open to the water. I'm sure the know of uh, Ilmo Koshekar, who was the help of his brother Jaco. Yakor has been making his. Our small town water, a bustling hub on the various business benches. The latest of these, Copper World, has a grand open just around the corner. I had a chance to talk about Ilmo a few questions for Copper Ilmo. What's Copper World all about? Uh, I'm glad you asked. Copper World is the world's greatest coffee themed amusement park for all ages, right here in our hometown of water. It's got all the rides, thrills, and excitement you could ask for. And of course, lots of delicious fresh coffee, both hot and iced. I thought that uh, the watery was like, I didn't know it was a separate town. Uh, put that in. How's a unique business idea come out? Well, as you know, I'm all about ideas, an idealist, you could say. But what's even more important to me that many sort of business. Oh, Jesus Christ. With my help, we can revitalize water rate, build it coming back up, bring tourists back in, and enjoy ourselves in the process too. Coffee World is just as much for the town people as it is for the out of towners. So then you should make it cheaper for in towners then if it truly is. Um, which attractions should the visitors be sure not to miss? Oh, that's like having to choose your favorite child. It's impossible. But the slow roaster is, of course, a wonderful ride full of mystery and magic. And the Expresso Specs uh, is sure to give you a thrill. Also, don't forget to drop by the Fresh Pot Gift Shop on your way out. You never know what treasures you might find. Coffee, at least, I bet. Raffles, karaoke, and skits. If they ever do a remaster of Control that fixes the fucking map, I'd probably play it. I did say I was not going to hide that shit anymore. Okay, now that I have a map, Okay, so what does it mean if something's a point of interest? Because I don't think there's anything else for me to do in here. Shoebox, break room. Danger okay, so swapping, break room, which means I can save game, and shoebox, which means I can store items. And what, what are the points of interest? Like, what is a point of interest mean in this game? I know what it means in Helldivers. I wonder if it means stuff to read about. Okay. Stay in here and just check real quick. Um, hopefully it doesn't give me any fucking spoilers. Well, uh, what are points of interest in Alan Wake 2? So they can be words of power. Okay, it says, some disappear and some don't. Um, it says they can also be words of power. I don't think Saga gets words of power, though. Isn't that just Alan that gets those? Because she gets gun upgrades, right? And Alan Wake gets words of power. Oh, I missed this. Found the phone from my Thomas Zane. A pinprick of light in an ocean of darkness. Tom's in it. Barbara Jagger and Dark Red. Cynthia Weaver's late at night. I wonder if those are the real people. Based on my own weight. Hmm? Discussing things early, great, and feeling this. So, so Thomas Zane's now a an art director? Why is my hood down again? Fuck, it's cold in here. It's been almost a year since the game's been out, too. That's how long it's been. 
It looks like there's someone I can walk or walk to, talk to over here. But that everything else is handled. New choices. Hello. Do you have a second? Oh, he's in here before. Ah, long time and no see, Miss Anderson. Uh, Tor and Odin are not here. They are uh, old tricksters always sneaking off. Old Sorry. Are they no, trickster gods? I wanted to ask you about something else. That knife placement makes me really uncomfortable. I can get having a knife kind of on the front, but like if you're a fatter dude, if you're chunky like I am, you don't put the knife so that the hilt holds your gut up. That is weird. Like that's got to be uncomfortable. It, like it's digging into his fat. Do you live around here? I live in Bright Falls. You've seen me around. I am Mr. Blum. You call me Vladimir. I work at the nursing home. I take care of your old people. We are on day trip, music, sauna, the good times. I bring them here in the bus. The elderly are very important. It's and it's a very nice bus. Thanks. Well, Helen Nursing Home. Hey, yeah. How's it going? Are, are you telling me all these people are dead? What did that note say, I wonder? There's a large Swedish population. Or Netherlands? Wherever they're from. You know what I'm saying. I am not good about... Um, that's the... Sauna? I guess I could try... Whoa. I just noticed how big Coffee World is. Yeah. Double check the sauna. Mom's family was from Sweden. I've always imagined Sweet. it kind of like this. Saunas, lakes. Seems nice. Enjoying the sauna? You bet. The steam is amazing on my creaky old joints. I'm just waiting for Ati to wrap up his show so we can crack open some beers. I've read that taking a sauna is good for preventing really? dementia. Yeah, and so is beer. I don't know Ever about beer. Of the cult of the tree. Love beer. The but... half deer, half man monsters. Oh, sure, I've heard of them. They're the reason I can't risk taking walks in the forest anymore. If one of them shows up, how am I supposed to get away? Fucking shoot. I them. can't run with a bad hip. Can you I'd shoot? Be killed for sure. Can you shoot? I could maybe use my crutches to defend myself. Can you shoot? Do you think that'd work? You're the professional. Probably smart just to stay in the sauna. For crutches now. are a terrible weapon. They are hollow, thin pieces of metal meant for vertical structural support only. The horizontal swinging and bashing you that you would typically see someone swing them with, like a baseball bat, would destroy the crutch deal very little damage. Your best bet is probably to put a spike at the bottom instead of a stopper and then use it as a stabbing weapon at a distance to you know to keep yourself safe um that being said your feet look like they're already turning into a corpse all right later hey Sarah, a sauna doesn't fix what ails ya you're a goner how the they fuck are you guys not cold as shit golden. I get you're inside a sauna and you're cooling off. There should be steam, right? But you're standing in a lake that's probably at, like, what? 50, 60 degrees? Fair enough. Yeah, I, I, I fear he's losing his grip on reality. I don't care to listen to pointless jibber-jabber. Not on the radio and not in the sauna. I feel like this area was set up before they flooded it. And I've been in a sauna forever. Was it 24 that I used to go to that kind of sauna? I think that's what it was. I miss using the sauna. I used to really enjoy sitting in the sauna after a really hard workout. You just sit there and sweat everything out. It was fantastic. It feels so good. Hot.
and said, you know when you see in movies they have like a lock on the sauna door? Why would the sauna door ever lock? Like, if you think about it, lock the entryway to a, like a mud room before you get in the sauna? Sure, that way someone can't be locked in there and fucking fried to death, but like, why do saunas and movies and shows always have locks on the door? I don't even know if I've been in a sauna that's had a lock on the door that I can remember specifically, like, looking and seeing a lock on it. Like, in Japan, or any of the other places, like, other countries, or in the U.S., I can't think of ever there being a lock on the sauna. Alright, one last check. Oh, you know what? Let me save, because I'm paranoid. Skip, like, 15 seconds forward, and you're good to go. I'm trying to do at least two hours of gameplay a week. But I kind of want to... I just don't want to stop. But I do want to stop playing because I'm hungry. But it's also... To put on a show or to talk while you play is a little bit draining. Not super draining, though. It's not harder than your job, man. Like, you go home and you... you your social batteries tonight. What was that one guy that was saying that, like, my job's harder than yours? Like, bitch, you're a streamer that makes millions of years. Like, you don't... Like, I don't even have a super crazy hard job. It's it's hard work, but it's not crazy hard, you know. There's a lot of knowledge that goes into it, and, like, stuff I'm still learning, of course, but... It is physically demanding at times, where you have to wear an acid gear and gas There's mask and turn wrenches. Need to get across the river. But I would... I don't know, I feel like that's a lot harder than being a streamer because I feel like more more people can be streamers than can do that job. If you'd ask me which I'd rather do to make money, stream, like play a video game and talk to people or that, play a video and talk to people. That being said, to get to that point does take a lot of hard work and consistently and um, doing it, well, I don't know. The guy that said that had a huge leg up because he's a bit that? of a Nepo baby. I don't remember my controls. I know that this is dodge and this is aim and I gotta flush the light up. Fuck! Oh, baby hatchet. Oh. FBI, show yourself! I got an itch on my leg. So, let's sit up. Get in tomorrow more like if I, you know, I'm ready to battle. You stop. Fucking A. More people turning into Taken. Is this the cult? Or the story? Or both? So go down already. Fucker. Fucker. Well, I've got way more ammo with the shotgun now, so let's use that. Yeah, let me explore these little side areas. It's a jump down. Hmm. Interesting.
missing looking shit. There's a rhyme over here. Moose doll. A gentle beast with a beautiful crown runs through the woods with a worried frown. From the hunter he flees between the mighty trees to make it out alive. Okay, so this is what? Oh, there's a leaf. There's a house. There's a ring and a necklace, I think. The sun. Okay, okay. Okay, what did that change? Oh, shit. Oh, shit, what? I only kind of half get how those puzzles work, you know? If that thing starts coming at me, I'm dropping it. Oh, damn. Another charm. Good thing Logan made me this bracelet. Ah, can't forget the dolls. Hmm? Might need them again. Was that the complete answer, though? I'm going to look it up because I don't give a fuck. Okay. Um. <coughs> fuck. I say I'm getting sick. Ugh. Coffee world. Uh, no, not wad. Uh, moose. Moose puzzle. Uh, okay, apparently there's Moose World and Coffee World, and I'm just getting, um, like, weird shit. Oh, Coffee Wood. Huh, that's probably why. Thanks for the no, fucking... Okay. Um. Wait, did I? I started looking up and it was trying to give me answers. It was like, hey, look up for this one, this one. You know what? I can't... Deer doll. Well, I can't place the moose again, so I must have done it right, right? And she specifically said to pick up the dolls, so... Oh my god. <clears throat> no. Oh. Dolls. Okay. I may not have clothespins. I remember there's a st I remember watching a cartoon as a kid where this kid's father made him little army men out of clothespins. He painted them in a little piece of wood. And he loved them until his classmates made fun of him. Like, oh, that's not a real toy soldier doll. And it's like, so what, man? Like, his father did his best. And it was, like, really sweet and cute. I hate inequality in the world sometimes, man. Like, shit's wild. Okay, rhymes. Doesn't look right. What? Oh, Cauldron Lake rhymes. Shooting range. At the shooting range. <laughs> Thanks, Saga. Duh. I'm just when the rhyme was completed. <sighs> hmm. 
No. No, no. What? No. Oh, where's the one with just generic rhymes? There we go. The FBC is definitely playing with things they don't fully understand. And that always goes well. Yes. It's... Yeah. I just have. Nope. But he's involved. Like, what do you mean? No. Wake says a story will change reality around us. If that's true, then I need to know what's real and what's fiction. Okay, I forgot that part. This is this stopped playing for so long. Dang, I filled out a bunch of shit. Okay, well, it doesn't appear I can keep using that one. <clears throat> and I think the deer statue appeared after. The deer toy appeared after, so I think I'm good. Um, mirror, mirror. Crossbow bolts. So this is a shooting range, by the way. For what? Okay, make it slightly six feet right here. I don't see them though. Like I don't. Oh, that. I bet that's it right there. Yeah, I just, I bet I can't get it because I don't have a crossbow yet. So why don't I turn the light off? Okay, stop fucking around. Yeah! Alright, um, I still want to go this way, I'm pretty sure. Get here, see if there's anything, nothing. Oh, you know what's gonna do? It's gonna do an image jump on my face because it's been a long time since it's done one. It's gonna do it in this stash up there. More cult symbols. Stash. Yeah, I'm fucking hungry. I really need to eat some protein. Or like drink some. Can I get the, this map? No? I already have it? Alright. I guess that's in case I didn't find it earlier. That little... As she went under, made me think something was gonna happen. Yeah. Another one of those cult boxes. Oh, one of these. This is easy. I found another dead taken over. Uh, I found another dead taken over. Another dead taken over by the radio tower. 
Luckily, it was bashed to death. There's a lunchbox and some weird knitting by the corpse too. Take care of the body, but that's the third of this month. Everyone keep our everyone keep your eyes peeled. We need to find this guy and let them know the cult of the tree means business. So they know about. Hello, something I almost missed. What had kept Watery afloat all these years? A century, if not more. The locals knew the answer. Grit. Or as they put it in the language of their Finnish forefathers, Sisu. Right these back. days, Take Sisu was needed there. more than ever. The town was fading. It never quite recovered from the lumber mill shutting its doors. Now the fishing was drying up as well. Most people had left to find jobs in other towns. Only the most tenacious stubbornly remained. Dug in. Parasites in the body of a terminal patient. Sisu. Some people tried to resuscitate the town. The Koskala brothers double-handedly warded off the impending darkness with their ventures. Coffee World brought tourists, money, and jobs. Coffee-themed fun for all ages. The Kalavala Knights Motorcycle Club built parade floats. The bikers repaired vehicles and volunteered locally. But it wouldn't be enough. Watery needed a miracle. The end of the road was in sight. That was coming fast. Yeah, so it sounds like they... They're the reason this town hasn't economically collapsed. Or collapsed to the darkness. Interesting. Who is messaging me on Discord? I'll bring it up here in case it's a private message. Oh, fucking cold. I gotta show some laundry. Oh, my wife. <laughs> okay. So I'm on Facebook. Get my face. Wife sent me this. Two cats in this house spilled 20 pounds of rice and then played with it all over the kitchen. That's adorable and fucking... That would be infuriating, but it's like... Yeah, I remember. They're the cats, right? They're not trying to be assholes. They just are naturally... Li li naturally... Li naturally little assholes, right? Little jerks. There's only one in here and he's asleep. No, the other two just got up and left. They don't like it when I enter and leave the room a lot. Um... But yeah, they're, they're not trying to make your life harder. They just don't realize what they're doing is a problem. She says container. Hmm. Is that her breathing I heard? Or someone else's. I don't know if I found some IR paint, or not IR. Or is it IR paint? The yellow, bright-ass yellow paint that I see sometimes. I don't know if it was some of that. And that's where I found the things. For this, yeah. Just want to make sure I explore everything. Sorry if I use the map a lot. I always like to double-check and make sure. Uh, well, yeah, let's get a generator up and going. Oh, hit enter. Uh-oh. It's interesting because it doesn't fall at the same rate. Like, it starts to speed up after a point. I'm guessing that's a safe place, so I'm gonna wait to go in there. It's been another half an hour already. Jeez, this is my third recording. This at least looks more like a gun range, but like, still. Not real. Like, where are you shooting from here? Outside of a pistol, what are you shooting with? And even then, that's not the greatest in the system. Like, you, should, you should really get farther out sometimes, too. Like, there are times you should practice 20 yard shots with pistols further, too. Man, I need to go shooting so much more. I need to practice so much more. Hey! 
If you take the crossbar out, put it back, and the session will be done. P.S. I changed the code as asked. Should I even be doing this? Does he even work this way? I'll get to maybe a hundred and then I will stop. But I don't really want to because it's kind of fun. I just don't want to stream this part, but it's okay. It's okay. Wait, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just tired. I don't want to backtrack. I don't really like backtracking much in games. Which is stupid, I guess. But I don't know. You know what it is? It's FOMO. I'm worried I'm going to miss something and then miss a, something crucial. I'm also... Don't know if... Do I want the new Dragon Age? I love Dragon Age 1. I've beaten Dragon Age 1 with every... character type you can make basically um you know dwarf noble dwarf commoner human noble human caster uh elf in an alienage elf as a caster elf in the wilds you know and i like dragon age 2 dragon 2 i i kind of want to make myself play again i don't like the dwarf companion that much. The Valka? What is the guy's name? I don't remember. Everybody likes that dude a lot, and I don't really like him that much. I don't know what it is. There's something about him I don't like, and I don't have a good excuse for that, so I don't really want to play Dragon Age 2 again because he's such a big part of it. And then he's a big part of Dragon Age 3. One of the first companions you get, if I remember right. And it's like, God damn it. Um, and I still haven't... I never beat Inquisition. And this one takes place after Inquisition. I actually have some spoilers for the new one because, like, what am I doing? Because people don't give a shit about spoilers, you know? People are assholes, but... I don't know. I... You know what? 170 is, is enough. That's farther enough. I don't need to do any more than that. Let me check to make sure I didn't miss it. Where do you find the crossbow code? Ellen Wake 2. Where do you find us? The thing I saw it said to just like look closely at where you've seen like signs of crossbow use. And it's like, well, how does that fucking help? I don't know what I believe. You only have two together. So hold on to one. I don't know what the alcohol's for. I'm guessing it uses Oh yeah, throwable gas container, duh. It doesn't right fuck in there. It's the second one of those I've gotten. Okay, why did I swap out anything else? Uh, I don't have max amount of pills yet, though, so we can toss the pills. I'll just take two bandages. In case I... You know what? Why don't I just use a bandage now? that like a fucking drug addict. Uh, Shit. Need more bullets. 
I increased it by 50%, right? So I increase it to like 18. They do that. The gun sounds really well in this, at least. Sounds really good. Fuck it. Fuck it. We're going, we going hard. Okay. Places. So this is the only other place I can think of. It's this place and that place. Let's go. Let's go back. This is why I can't be a streamer. I'm just fucking like, ah, oh, fuck this. I'm gonna do this instead. Yeah, I would do this. Bad though. Give me at least a hint of what to look for. Um, yeah, that was this way. Before I talked to the news boy. So these are ranges? Okay, there was a crossbow bolt here. Was that the only one? Is it a three maybe? Three bottles or three pieces of wood? Shot into the right one. Three pieces of wood standing. Shot lower right. And it's got three bottles on top. Two and one. Three, two, one? I don't know. That's probably stupid. There's also blood this way. I've had something really stupid simple and I'm missing it. Right? And then there's bolts here, right? Wait a minute. Two, five, seven. Is it that easy? Oh, wait, they each have different numbers. So I bet it's five, two, seven. Is it that easy? Am I just stupid? Is it really that easy? So in Skyrim, before opening the thing, I couldn't figure it out. I was also drinking a lot back then, too. Not a strong uh, critical thinking. I didn't know you could inspect items, though. So I would have never saw them because I didn't know you could just turn the thing over and see the claws with the three dots on it. Which means, like, why even have the password on it? It is that simple. If you aren't wearing the mask, this does not belong to you. Well, fuck it does now, bro. Shit, maybe I should have saved before. Or not saved before, but, like not um upgraded any guns before i got this i'm thinking about it i don't know what like what if the crossbow bolts automatically break until i upgrade something so that they don't because that would make a huge difference i'm also gonna go you know what we're gonna get a bunch of crossbow bolts anyways now let me go collect them first then i'll go throw them in there and my brother's like just play the game you're good enough to shoot us just play the game Play the story. No, I'll play it my way. Watched a video recently, and it's like, average stalker experience. And it was eight minutes of highly edited just memes and shit. Like, I, was, I thought it was going to be, like, a really quick, like, someone just chatting about the game that they like real quick. Um, and, it, and it's like, man, I kind of miss stalker and all the weird bugs and stuff. And I played those games. I never really played them when they first came out, I don't think. I played him like, well, no, that's not true. I played a little bit in 2008, I think, one of them. But I played mostly when I came back from the military and we're just fucking around with them, I think. You know what? Let's just fucking, oh, Steam. Steam. Hey, look, the other clips. That's Super 5.1. I haven't uploaded. Here's a bunch of Hell There's 2 clips I haven't fucked with yet. Um... Perfect. 11 hours does not tell me last time I played. And 4.6 does not tell me last time I played. March 6th, both on console. 
Oh, manual. August of last year. Interesting. Soccer board game adaption. This one looks like it has more stuff on community, so I bet this is the newer one. I thought I'd play them both more than that, because I played one of them a fuckload, I felt like, but maybe not. I don't know. Um, my view of time, your view of time, everyone's view of time gets altered when you're, when you're drinking. I thought I had a ton of hours in, like, that that one game that got delisted, uh, the, the Jurassic Park one that got delisted, that Telltale made. It said I had, like, two hours in it, but I was like, I could have sworn I played a fuckload of that trying to get through it. But I was probably just hammered drunk, stuck on just stupid areas, because, you know. Oh, you're drinking. Did I miss a menu? Wow. Saga was beginning to see why Casey disliked the woods so much. They felt oppressive here. Too many places to hide. The distorted carnival music drifting from the amusement park ahead did not help. What the Coscalus had said about her living in Watery with Logan unsettled her. For the horror story to involve her was one thing, but involving her daughter was crossing the line. Something darted across the path ahead. Too fast to see. Saga drew a weapon. Her eyes searched the woods. A noise overhead. Saga swiveled to look. A local. A man on the ridge above her. No, not a man. A monster with a hatchet in each hand. It shouted down at her. Hunting season was a bust. Okay, I thought it might be the last guy, but I don't think he yelled at me. Uh, let's look at what we... Cross bone bolts. Pull the string. Hold the fire button. To... That's kind of cool. Like a mark and destroy. We've been ta I've been talking about a friend about getting into bow hunting. We want to we're thinking about getting a uh, recurve bows and going bow hunting and stuff. And I want to learn to field dress a deer. I just never have. I've never had anyone take me hunting. My dad never did. In fact, I don't even think I've seen my dad around any guns ever. I have very few memories of him outside the house, even. So if we weren't going to the movies or to the store, I miss a container over here? Then he didn't leave the house. Kind of thing, you know? Yeah, but I can't get it in. Oh, I was like, I was reading the description of that key, and I was like, what? I thought it was describing where I needed to get the thing for a second. All right. That reminded me of something, but I don't know what. Like that connected that guy's voice and stuttering talk reminded me of something from like a movie or a character. And then immediately faded away from memory. And I'm like, what the fuck was that? I could. Can I see? Fuck. Why is the map blurry to load? Load the assets I look at, not any of the others. God's eye. So there should be like a stash over here, right? List of favorite park benches in Bright Falls. And now, I just want to clear something up from our last broadcast. There was some talk, an off-color joke of sorts, about Wendy Davis and Davis family beef jerky being dead. Which, of course, is a bunch of hogwash. So I'm going to give our dear friend Wendy a call so we can put an end to these silly rumors. And, oh, it looks like we already have one. This is Jim Bigamore. Remember, we were going to do the announcement today. Oh, is that was that today? Uh, listeners, we have Jim Figamore with us and the director of the Bright Falls Community Theater. And and I'm here to announce that the theater will be losing one of its most dignified thespians. As I, Jim Figamore, will be running for mayor. 
poll for applause. Well, that's uh, quite a, an announcement, Jim. Just let me find my notes here. I have some questions written down for you. The real question is what happened to this town. Bright Falls used to draw in thousands of tourists with its vibrant art scene and impressive Ooh, bird figures. And what's our reputation now? Haunted Bright Falls. Spooky Bright Falls. The world is laughing at us. No, we're laughing. And now all this business with the FBI? We need a... I really like this world being like this, but please, for the love of God, let me have a radio on me where I'm listening to it so I can explore while doing this. Just like the manuscript pages. I could, didn't you used to be able to listen to them and walk around, or were you stuck in that page the whole time? who can turn this town's reputation around, and nobody knows more about the role of mayor than I do. I played one in the theatrical production of Fiorello, to glowing reviews by Coffee World magazine. Mayor Setter is a joke, and you know what? She put her hand in front of the barrel. And it looks like she is, right? She's going like. Now, like, Jim, this is a family show. Ah, like it goes in front of the barrel for a moment. So I do it with a gun, but I don't want to actually do that question. unless it's unloaded. What exactly goes into that delicious beef jerky? Uh, right. So it looks like these are my questions for Wendy Davis of Davis Family Beef Jerky. <laughs> the only what? jerk I care about what? is Mayor Setter. Our future's at stake. What? Pets are being murdered. He's still time to eat your baby. It's time for a change. <clears throat> Jim she ring Bigamore for right. mayor. She got two more hours, baby that boy. That concludes our program today. Oh, I, this I little boy, Jim he's whining at you. Can't Pat see it, but it's this guy. He's whining at me for FO deeds. The little brother standing right next to him. And I'm like, Queen Mouse, Queen Mouse, fall over. We've been talking for. Oh, wait, you can't even hear me. They're going to get wet F-O-O-D later. Um, and they don't even know it. Uh, they can't spell, by the way, because my kids are stupid. So. They're just blissfully unaware. Well, not blissfully. They uh, they believe that they're starving to death. But, you know, whatever. Cats are going to cat. Another rhyme. Okay. 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 Three little deers ventured to roam and found a nice place to eat and play. One little deer never came home, and two of the deers cried all day. Found a little place to eat and stay. That's not right. Nope. Why would they stay in a cabin? Right. What did that did that put something on the map near me? Like I, I did the thing. Oh, you know what? I'm stupid. Of course the deer in the house. It's the cult of the tree. The guys in the deer masks. So I'm guessing they came here, maybe sacrificed a guy in the cabin or something. There's a tree over here. Or uh uh an actual... Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh! Can't give me the light, bitch. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Shit. Bitch. Fuck you. Fuck you. Come here, bitch. I ain't done. No, you too, bitch. Do you, they don't have any protection from the thing, right? Or do they? Am I just wasting ammo? <laughs> bitch. Switch guns, please. Thank you. Come on. Right into it. Come on, run into it, bitch. Good job, Saga. Now keep moving. Apparently, pistol's not the way to deal with them. So I kind of noticed, like, if they're standing here, you can't see it. If they're standing, let's say this tree is one of them, and they're standing there, they're going to run directly into it, lap out. 
five feet before I jump. So if I just aim right there and pop them. Full shotgun blast to the mouth. Well, at least I got more pistol rounds. Deer A charm. charm. Miss anything else over here? No. I don't, it doesn't look like it. I don't think I can get up this radio tower or into this area. Hello? I thought I saw a symbol. Maybe it was just the way. Yeah, that almost looks like a, a circle symbol, right? The way it glints if I run quick. Yeah, it's because it's the handle and the handle is a circle shape. That's why. Another Alex Casey lunchbox? Well, where? 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 Oh, right there. I was like, I know it's got to be just past in this area. I loaded my rifle, standing on the car's roof. I looked out at the pines. The zombies almost, the zombies had almost won, but luckily I was here. Heroes are sometimes the people we least expect in the game. Now my town was finally safe, thanks to me. I slung off the hot piece of iron over my shoulder one more time, hopefully for the last time. The townspeople cautiously emerging from their hiding places, surveyed the carnage. I saw and cheered my name. I waved and they cheered again. Now I could finally get back to my quiet and assumed life, bringing books and gardening and fiber crafts and being the world's top mycology expert. And I can't fucking scroll again. Yeah, look, I... Uh, mouse wheel's not doing it anymore. Why does it do this? Maybe... Can scroll now, huh? Whatever. I guess I don't get to read the fucking rest. I mean... How the fuck am I supposed to read this shit down here? God damn it, that's so fucking annoying. How are you gonna release a DLC that fucks up the mouse wheel? And it's been a, like two weeks. Well, at least, a, well, no, yeah, it has been like two weeks, because it's a week since the last time I played, too. Unless I have this until I need to. <laughs> Swap it out. I hate that it says container, but it, like it's locked. I can't get into it, and I don't know where the key is, so I have to access it. But hopefully, there's a save point. I mean, there's a save point right there, so I should just use that one. In fact, I'm at an hour, another hour. Let's go back and save. Stocking the stagger is probably a little bit more important for now, anyway. I'm not going to do more of crazy, but... Alright. Uh, I'm going to call it here for now. I don't know why I just made a new save. So short, but I, um, I hope you're enjoying it. I'm going to keep playing. Uh, probably. I'm going to get some protein or something. And probably shit a third time. So... Uh, coffee World! Yeah. <laughs>